Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada. Matchup between UNLV and Air Force here on the Mountain West Network on Stadium. Jordan Bell, pull-up jumper, and just like the last game against New Mexico, Jordan Bell starts it off with UNLV with a jump shot. Shot attempt. That one from the free throw line is too strong by Autry. Long cross-court pass, and it gets in the hands of Jordan Bell from Alyssa Anderson. <laughs> And Jordan Bell has her second field goal of the ball game. Five seconds remaining on the shot clock. Springfield driving and rejected by Katie Powell. What a block by the senior. R.J. Wade gets the board. Here comes Smith. Smith trying to go coast to coast, and she does. Leticia Smith off the backboard and in gives UNLV a two-point lead. Alyssa Anderson. Anderson has some separation, and Alyssa Anderson kisses it off the backboard and in. There she goes again. Here's Smith. Smith trying to get the foul call. Hard. That was a tough looking jumper there by Leticia Smith. Turnaround fadeaway in the corner, but was able to get that one to go down. Nice play. And she is just tough on both ends. Here's Justice Etheridge, gives Ooh. it down low to Wade. Nice feed, and RJ Wade is able to finish it off from the assist from Justice Etheridge. Alyssa Anderson was able to spin the ball away. She's in trouble. Gives it to RJ Wade. Wade, nice stop there by RJ. A hard earned victory for the Lady Rebels. Win this one, they improve to 4-11 and 11 on the year, 2-2 two two in conference play, while Air Force falls to 5-11, and 1-4 and four in conference play. Today, today felt like a, a Mountain West Conference tournament game. We're in TMC, we're playing in front of a great crowd, elementary school day, hopefully the kids had a great time, but a good performance, Katie Powell played excellent, uh, we had other people step up, TT did a good job, Leticia Smith, Caviana, uh, Brown did a good job backing up Nikki Wheatley. I mean, right now we're gelling as a team. We got to continue to grow and get better every day in practice. Live at the Thomas and Mack Center here, where UNLV beats Air Force, and glad to be joined for the first time this year by Katie Powell, who you finally picked up your first double double of the year. I know you really enjoy that stat line, but for you today, uh, great performance on both sides of the ball. How did it feel out there? It felt great. Uh, I was waiting for my double double this year. I'm doing it all for my mom and for my teammates, anything I can do to help. <laughs> now you went five of nine from the field. Uh, didn't get the three-point shot. I know you're going to be frustrated with that. But the free throw line, very impressive today, nine of ten. Now when you were out, obviously you guys struggled at the free throw line. How impressed was it for you and as a team to be able to, when you're called upon at the charity stripe, to get those to go down? It's all about confidence at the charity stripe, actually. We always work on free throws before practice. We shoot 50 a day. And, I mean, it's really been helping, and it shows. Now for you guys, this is back-to-back -back wins the first time this year. Not the start that you guys wanted, but you guys are building confidence. How big are it, you know, does it feel, big wins against New Mexico, now here against Air Force, that we're back in our rhythm, hopefully? No, yeah, I mean, it feels great. Our goal is like 16-game win streak. That's what we're trying to do. And New I mean, New Mexico is a really good team in our conference, and Air Force is actually really hard to beat because they never give up. And we did our best, and we beat them. All righty, Katie, thank you. And you didn't forget your questions, so that's good. Good yeah. job today, as Katie Powell, Gets her first double. <laughs>